Good morning. Day 20. Um, totally don't feel like doing this today. Um, I'm cranky and I'm just, I'm just, I just don't feel like doing it, but I want to do it at the same time because I know it's going to get me a better life. So I'm going to walk on this treadmill, make it a pretty good slow climb, incline today. Um, and make it like a steep climb. And so anyway, I'm just trying, I'm gonna burn off some of this negative energy because I am just feeling salty this morning. Um, day 20, um, I'm feeling overwhelmed too, just with everything I have to do um, for Christmas and getting everything lined up, keeping everybody happy. Um, and then I'm starting, <laughs> I, I got to get out of this. This is why I need to just sweat it out. I think this is like the answer and is, uh, I just feel like nobody's understanding. You know what I mean? It's that whole mentality of you getting in that mindset, like nobody sees all the work I'm doing and all this stuff. Like I'm going into like martyr syndrome. Oh my gosh, I'm freezing and it's cold down here got my fleece leggings on <laughs> again today. So I'm going to do this workout. I'm going to get out of this bad mood and then I'm going to start my day. And so I don't feel like doing this, but I know by the end of it, I'm going to be happy I did. And there's a difference between whether you feel like it or not. You got to just do it. It doesn't matter how you feel. Um, and I'm practicing this with staying consistent and committed is it doesn't matter how you feel. You signed up to do it, you do it. And I'm not letting myself off the hook this time. I'm locked in. And so I'm getting on here to tell you about how the day 20 is starting. And this is not going to be my whole day. I'm going to have a good day. I'm going to get out of this. I'm gonna get out of this funk. I'm gonna sweat it out. <laughs> so we will check back with you guys later, day 20. Hi guys. Oh my. We are on workout two, day 20. Um, it's icy. And I cannot find my little tripod thing, my little extender I don't want to blame my kids but I'm wondering if they were playing with it I have to ask them so I'm on my walk full full day did I tell you guys that I this is like the week before the week of Christmas and so basically I want to get all my shopping done and I'm affectionately calling this my holly jolly hell week um because just a lot has to get done this week um, <clears throat> leading up to everything. And we also have a lot of other commitments coming down. Well, you guys all know what Christmas time is like. Um, so it'll be good though. It's all good. Taking one thing at a time, one day at a time, and just prioritizing and executing as things come along. Something that nobody talks about about this time of year too is I know there's hustle and bustle of the year, but because these are a lot of, like a lot of the tasks, like making the Christmas cookies, doing the gingerbread houses that I'm doing and shopping for them, all of that, you're not used to doing them. So it's like my time management has been off a little bit because it's like, I know how long it takes me to get ready in the morning every day. I know how long it takes, you know, to get the kids around and all that. So I think one of the things that's kind of taken me off my game is I am underestimating how much time all of this stuff is taking and it's showing. 
<laughs> so that's okay. But um, that's what I'm thinking. It's like taking a little longer. Ooh, now this is all muddy. So I've gone from ice to mud, but day 20. So this morning I was super salty um, and annoyed uh, just about life. Whoop, sorry guys. And um, I worked out. I put that old incline up to 12 on the treadmill today. And I put it at like 2.4 miles per hour or something. So it was like a good steady climb. And you know, by the end I felt good. I was sweating. I felt really good. Um, but you know, just the stress of the day is getting me a little bit today. Um, definitely feeling overwhelmed, but I'm kind of on the home stretch right now because I was able to get a lot of stuff done today. So as soon as I'm done with my walk, I need to race and change, go get my kids, get them to take, go for haircuts. And then we have like a bunch of stuff to do this evening. That's like back to back to back. So anyway, whew, it's icy, slowing down here. Um, but I'm just thinking about all this stuff, thinking about what's all this taking. Um, and this right here, this walking right here, doing the workouts, doing the program, it's worth it. Like it's really worth it. This is the time to do it. You know, I'm really glad I didn't wait till the first of the year to do it. I'm glad I just did it and started it now. <coughs> it's just, it's really nice to draw a line in the sand is what I'm realizing today. As frustrated as I felt this morning, but you know what, this line is drawn. I'm doing it, I'm doing it this time. And so that's that. And that's how I'm thinking about it. And that's how I'm thinking about it today. You know, tomorrow I might be struggling hardcore. Um, but I'll take that in stride as well tomorrow. But for lunch, I had my ground beef zucchini little burrito bowl thing. And for dinner, I'm going to have uh, a salad kit with my chicken on there. So anyway, got my plan. I'm executing everything the best I possibly can. Um, not only with 75 hard, but just with my life and in this season. And so something else that I've noticed on this challenge, you know, only being on day 20 here, is when I lay my head down at night, I know I went all in on my day, you know? And can't say that I've ever, not ever, but you know what I mean? Like when I lay my head down, oh glory, one moment. When I'm laying my head down tonight, I'm going to be tired. And I also know that like I did something today, you know, I put in the work. I did the best for my family. I know I've managed my time the best that I possibly can given the circumstances and the challenge I've signed up for, like the challenge I've put myself in and the commitment I've put myself in. And it's just nice. That's something that I've never noticed until recording every day on my day for 75 hard, you know? So that's all I got for you today, y'all. Um, I'm sure I'll try to jump on again tonight. If not, I will see you guys tomorrow. I'll put some pictures up of my meals, um, so you can see them. Ooh, now I got to switch back at the center. It's like all ice, <laughs> but stay cool.